This is John Paul Rai. I'm coming to you from Tokyo, Japan, and I got an article here from people called Angelina Jolie cleared to sell share of her and Brad Pitt's wine label valued at $164 million. Jolie has been allowed to sell off her shares in the winery and estate, which is where she married Pitt back in 2014. This story is pretty new, and apparently, according to people here, it is already resolved. Brad Pitt and Angelina Jolie's latest legal dispute over the former couple's $164 million French estate has been resolved, they say. According to new court documents obtained by People, Jolie, 46, has been allowed to sell off her shares in the winery and estate, which is where she married Pitt back in 2014, to a third party. Jolie previously ran into problems selling her shares in Queenicum, the company that owns and controls Chate Miraval, because of her and Pitt's ongoing divorce. In July, she asked the California court to allow the sale, despite the fact that they were still finalizing their divorce proceedings according to court documents obtained by People. When the two actors first purchased their shares in Quinnicum in 2008, their respective companies split the ownership 60-40, with Mondo Bongo holding the majority share. In 2013, the split even to 50-50, when Mondo Bongo transferred some shares to Novell, the lawsuit obtained by People said. The documents claimed Pitt 57 sold Julie the shares back in 2013 for a symbolic price of 1 euro below the trade value of her stake and is now arguing the transfer should be voided. Right, so obviously they were worth a lot more than 1 euro and he's saying that that should be voided because I'm guessing he would have sold it for a lot more than that had he known they were getting this divorce and we're going to have these problems down the line. Angelina Jolie and Brad Pitt are currently battling in court over custody of their children. The couple share six children together, three of whom were adopted internationally. The duo were a couple for almost 12 years before separating and was known by couple came Brangelina. Okay, I think I remember that, but not quite. Anyway, kind of silly. I actually get a little irritated by those couple names. The duel got close to each other on the sets of the movie Mr. and Mrs. Smith while Pitt was married to Jennifer Aniston at the time. Jolie and Pitt married on August 23rd, 2014 at their estate in France. After two years of marriage, the couple separated on September 15th, 2016. On September 19th, Jolie filed for divorce citing irreconcilable differences. Now. I'm going to say something just off my gut feeling. I just think that Jennifer Aniston seemed like a nicer person. She just seemed more modest and she seemed happier to be with Brad Pitt. Now maybe there's stuff going on under the surface I don't know about. I'm sure there's details I don't know about because I'm mostly interested in the main parts of this case because I don't know Brad Pitt and Angelina so well. It's just when I see Aniston, I just get good vibes from her in general. And Angelina Jolie, I just get these mixed feelings. It just seems like she's a little out to prove something, seems like she's a little more strict perhaps. I just get a different feeling from her aura just from her as a person. Like I said, that's my speculation. I could be wrong, but that's my feeling. And I thought this was resolved with the children's custody. I thought Brad Pitt got a win with that. Apparently, it's still going. Apparently, the judge had some kind of connection with Brad Pitt. He did not want to admit or fess up or put in legal documents or something like that. So I think the battle goes on. You guys, of course, let me know what you think down below. Doing shout outs, special thanks, things like that. If you're not subscribed here, consider it. If you consider it and you still don't subscribe, well, I guess I'll be sad, but I'll get over it. See you next time.